Why is he falling over like that? So you don't, you don't need to be there. Why? Oh, if you play the video, man. Yes, now, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Simon Reacts. Today, you are joined by the dynamic duo, Jizzlypuff and Jeez. Bazinga. Um, come on. And today, we're going to be watching Funniest Football Manager Press Conferences. Come on, um, This one caught my eye in the compilation list, so I'm intrigued to see what happens. Hello, Sidemen. I like it when they talk to, to us. React session, where today, Hello. we're going to be showing you some of the funniest Football Manager Press right. Conference moments. Let's First go. up, it's Louis van Gaal. Who you might oh, yes. notice features Toby, heavily in favorites. this compilation. Oh my God. Now the fans are shouting every week, Louis van Gaal's army! <laughs> Louis van Gaal's army! <laughs> Nailed it. So and now, let's talk about six, baby. Let's talk about <laughs> eight, baby. Let's talk about all the good It's actually going to be sad when he leaves the Premier League. It is, you know. Let's talk about six. Six. This video <laughs> is already mental enough, but let's not sleep on this guy trying his best to join in throughout. Six. But look, we're going to react to some of your reactions in relation to this announcement. Yes, Mark Goldbridge did conduct his own press conference ahead of the Sidemen charity <laughs> match last year. Uh, many Legend. people are saying, um, is it deliberate that the Sidemen always give you no defenders and put it on <laughs> Why? Look, Why I'm not here to comment that, about that. It's for charity at the end of the day. You do the maths. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is deliberate. <laughs> yeah. Also, by the way, uh, for, for people that like watch the Simon Terry matches and stuff, yeah, Goldbridge was such a fucking good addition to have because like, he created the content around it, done like full on live stream press conferences and shit. Rose the goat of like playing that role. Yeah, 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 he did so well. That's Murata, isn't it? Yeah, bro is the biggest scoundrel. Is this one of the most iconic press conferences ever? Uh, which one? <laughs> which one do you think? I'm asking you. No, well, I'll, I'll, I'll leave it then. If if you're going to be tricky like that, I won't even bother to, you know, carry on. So he's not in the mood at all. Here, shall we? I mean, be tricky, way like be tricky with your questions. Boy. So what wait, 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 wait. Okay. So, so, you know, let's, let's not take the piss here. <laughs> I well, I think yes. you are. I'd hate to get on the wrong side of him. Yeah, that's a goat right there. Let's start again. Boy. It was a genuine question. Well, I won't mention it then. You know, there wasn't a fucking penalty in the game. There were situations in the game. That didn't happen. So let's just talk about our performance. Roy, a satisfying day at the office? Yeah, I thought we played very well. <laughs> First half, particularly, it was, a, it was a pretty even contest, did you not feel? Not particularly, no. I thought we had the better of the first half, and I thought we had clearly the better of the second half. It's amazing, amazing. <laughs> oh, Ranieri, my guy. Hey, man, we are in Champions League. We are in Champions League, man. That was my next Dilly ding, dilly dong, come on. <laughs> I'll tell you what, another Dilly ding, dilly dong. I've never seen that clip before. I haven't seen that before. Uh, dilly ding, dilly dong. We are in Champions, Champions League, League, man. man. That was my next Dilly ding, dilly dong, come on. <laughs> I'll tell you what, another person said, are you scared, Mark? Are you scared of the side men? And I'll tell you what, I'm scared of sharks. If I'm in the water and there's a great white shark coming towards me, I'm scared. Am I scared of their best player last year, let's say, Mini Minter. Am I scared? No. I don't think Mini Minter's a shark. Having met him, he's more like a dolphin. He's very friendly. <laughs> he's got a smiley face. He and he'll do anything scared. he can to help you yep. in a crisis. I'll tell you what they should be scared of. I was on the phone this morning to Aviva trying to get some insurance <laughs> for my team on the weekend. And they said, absolutely not. You're too risky. And we probably, if we had a choice between insuring Goldbridge Ball or insuring sky, <laughs> skydiving, We'd ensure the skydiver. You are that risky. When I said, you know what, it's disappointing. I can't get insurance, but thank you for the compliment. Risky Goldbridge ball. <laughs> I'll tell you what, United could do with some fucking risky Shut Goldbridge ball right now. Up. You Ethan, lot of fucking Ethan, when I tell you, my head bro. is still steaming. You, you lot are my so head is bad. steaming. <laughs> Why is Dallo doing that in the 96th minute? Ten Hag has now got the same amount of losses as David Moyes did, as this geezer did, and Ragnik. Why is he still there? Ethan, the game was in the bag! <laughs> it is a penalty, though. He did fall into him. <laughs> You, just don't, you, don't, you don't need to be there. Why? Oh, if you play the video, my head's hot. A lot of times oh, I, I use the word uh, horny, uh, horny to my place. <laughs> True enough. Ah, <laughs> oh, I missed one. Miss one. He's Look a baller. The pain behind this poor man's He's eyes. He's a baller. People are saying that this XQC in goal. Uh, sorry, not XQC. Yeah, XQC in goal. Never played in goal before Goldbridge. You'd be better with Stevie Wonder in goal. Well, I tell you what. Stevie Wonder in goal might not do very well, but he sings really good songs, and I'm sure XQC's got his attributes. <laughs> well, I think you must have been either um, head in the clouds, away on holiday, or reporting on a different team. 
If you don't know the answer to that question, then I think you're, you, you, are, you are an ostrich. <laughs> I need the Leicester gaffer that caught, got caught with some of the players having like a big orgy in Thailand before pre-season. Shut the fuck up. They did their pre-season tour there and he was caught with like a couple of players having like a big fucking orgy with some potential no. lady men. How have I missed this? It was funny, man. <laughs> Is your head in the sand? Can you, are you flexible enough to get your head in the sand? <laughs> My suspicion would be no. I can, you can't. Now, do you want to ask a different question, or do you want to ask it differently? Go on, come on, ask it, ask it. <laughs> or you're not capable. I, I, I just don't he is what. so patronising. Yeah. What? You, um, you don't know uh, what um. <laughs> yeah. Well, you must be very stupid. <laughs> Jesus. What about Chris MD coming back, kissing the badge of Sidemen last year when he de defecated? <laughs> Defected, defected. Defected. I mean, I <laughs> to go to the side men. Defected, defecated means shit. Well, he sort of did shit on us a little bit, kissing the badge. What punishment should he get? Well, he's got friends in high places, Chris MD. Has and he? I'm not talking about Peter Crouch. When, when you see them. what what Hood is doing with Falani, yeah, that's Falani. a penalty. Shall I grab you where you hire? And, and what 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 is your uh, reaction when I where grab is he you? Now, Louis Van Gaal? Is it, was he not doing national team? He was national team, right? Still. Or, or he might have. He, I think he sacked it in. Mm. Yeah. So he sacked. He sacked it in. Netherlands national team manager. He stopped in 2022. So yeah, he, he finished after. The, the football was awful to watch, but I did miss him. Every human being who is crap with the hair, only with uh, 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 with sex ma masochism. <laughs> Then it is uh, allowed, but not uh, in other situations. And they did it, and they did it several times, I think. It's players I hardly know. Some of them have never, you know, some of them, I'm literally going to have to say, you're in goal, mate. Your job is to stop the ball. It's my job to give context to you guys as this video is going on. Oh, this but one's I'm going fucking to be great. I'm completely honest when this I say great. I haven't got a fucking clue what this next bloke is on about. This is amazing. Tie at home against Bromley this weekend. What's your thoughts ahead of the game? If a tree falls and no one can, <laughs> is there to hear it fall, Does it make doesn't a make sound? a noise. <laughs> so, does a penguin get cold? <laughs> what way does your bath water go? Clockwise or anti-clockwise when you take the plug out? You know, these are questions which are going to be asked of us. Let me stop you right there, <laughs> because I really want to know why you're expecting to be asked the fucking question, does a penguin get oh. cold whilst you're in the middle of a football game? So good. These are questions we've got to have the answers to. Oh, fuck me. Seeing as you're so concerned about it, We've Googled it for you and found out that penguins do get cold. It's staying warm <laughs> thanks to their thick feathers and blubber. Good job, AI, man. Well done, AI. Now you know for when that never comes up during the 90 minutes. Um, you know, we're always looking for solutions and we've got to come up with the, you know, solve the equation sometimes. But, you know, Sam's had you, a I think you've already cooked there, you know. He's to grow out now. He did. He's here working silently away. <laughs> Robbie's over there. It's the first time he's been quiet today. <laughs> Terry's brought a briefcase in, you know. He's got four... <laughs> Japanese talking dogs in there. But, is know, this a prank? This is, this is what we work with. And we to work hard. So We've good. just heard from one mental it's Mark. So good, it's now man. time to listen to the famous Mark White, manager of National League side Dorking Wanderers, who Jeez. gave by far and away the most honest post-match interview you will ever hear. Mark, how disappointed are you? Not only with the result, but with the performance. Yeah, I mean, the performance was... Absolutely abysmal. He's I want to good. Uh, all of their YouTube. fans, they're brilliant yeah, fans. They deserve to be manager, uh, fully deserve to be in the draw, and hopefully, I really hope uh, they get something amazing that's life changing, so my fucking shit players <laughs> can <laughs> learn a fucking lesson. Sometimes I get the management so team to take the blame, part blame, some blame, whatever. Today was wholeheartedly a bunch of players. That were absolutely you dumped it on them. shit. Bro, 100%. The team not to turn up. He's the great. Cup is scandalous. Um, oh a fair God. chance they're all going to get fined to fuck. Oh, it's Dorkin, Eden, sorry. Dorkin. Yeah, they said Dorkin. Yeah, that's what He's I was He's Dorkin. I, I don't know how I've got word in Dorkin uh, confusing. But no, he got uh, he got banned by the FA from, from being on the sideline for like a couple of games or whatever. So he fucking dressed up as a mascot. And what? Was, yeah, bro, it's so funny. Like, Shut he's, up. He's great, man. What some of the Dawkins shit is unreal. He's so good. Some funny press conferences. Uh, remember, like the video, subscribe, and goodbye.